to tie a caddis pattern using virtual nymph, nymph skin. Um, so I call this a VN caddis for virtual nymph. I'm starting with a size 12 scud hook in the vise. I primarily tie these in 14s, but hopefully this comes out a little better on camera. I'm going to add some additional weight to this, so I'll take some turns of lead wire and break off either end, push it together and situate it uh, about the middle of the hook shank there. I'll secure it with uh, 70 black thread. I'll start with turns in front, reach back, turns behind and through, and I'll leave it just in front of the lead there. Remove the tag. Then I can tie in my nymph skin. I tie this in three different colors. This is going to be uh, their caddis green. I also tie it in a translucent and then put a little green sharpie on the back of it and then also in a in a tan or their light tan. I'll cut it in an angle so that I can attach it to the front and then I'll stretch it as I tie it in and work it down the hook shank and back up and leave the thread behind or the eye and in front of the lead and I can start to take my turns overlapping by half each turn And then when I get to my thread, I'll just hold it up and tie it off. Stretch it and trim it. Take a couple more turns for good measure. And now for the legs, I'm going to use a soft hackle. And I'll take and remove the bottom bits. and then peel the fibers away from the very tip and then I'll remove that and that will create a nice V and I can set that on either side of the pattern and then I can secure it with my thread wraps adjust if need be and then trim for the thorax, I'm going to use an ostrich hurl, and in this case I'll use a gray. I'll take two strands, remove the ends, and tie them in. And I'll leave the thread just behind the, the eye. And then I'll wet my fingers so that when I start to wrap this it'll bring the fibers back instead of on top of each other with the next wrap start to create a little fuller thorax here as I go And then when I get to my thread, I'll tie it off, take two wraps, and then again I'll, I'll wet my fingers and pull everything back so I can fold it on top of itself and create a nice head there. And then whip finish, and then I can remove the thread and the hurl make any adjustments that you need drop a head cement if you like and that is the virtual nymph or VN caddis